Hey guys, here's the update on the uh, 82 core Thunderbird uh, dual alternator install. I finally got my 200 amp power master in, and uh, here it is right here. I already had a, a power master 140, so I just left it in and added a 200 amp alternator. So I'm getting like 340 amps uh, at idle. This one puts out like 144 at uh, 850 RPM, and that one does like. Uh, 80 amps at uh, 850 RPM. So with all that being told, I'm getting like 225, 26 amps at idle, sitting still at 850 RPM, which I put a tack meter in the car, which I can adjust it being that it's an old car, I can adjust my tack meter up to higher than 800, 850 RPM, which is at like nine to a thousand right now. But my plan is when I get to shows, I can idle my car up to at least 1500 RPM up under the hood and just let it idle at idle. But uh, here's, here's basically it. I got a lot of zero gauge running from each alternator to the battery. Uh, right now the car's not charged because I've been sitting here playing with my amazing highs. It's really like 14.5 right now, which I've seen 14.7 up front. Both of these alternators sit at 14.8, but I seen 14.7 up front at idle. Um, drop, drop from 14.7 down to 14.1 with everything on, and that's damn good because hey, I've been in the 11.9s and the 12s, so hey, I'm, I'm getting up out of those range, so I'm up in the 13s and 14s now. That's, that sounds all good to me. But anyway, like I said, off of cardio, off cardio got like uh shit 12 eights in here 12 eight inch mid ranges i got eight six and a halves i got eight super tweeters i got four four inches in the dash and then three three and a half inches in the dash and along with like 12 12 to 16 soft dome tweeters in this car pushing about six seven thousand watts on subs four fifteens so this is all going to do me good this summer, 2015. Here I come. Peace.